obviously I think the more time that you spend in the middle of a horse and the more time you spend swinging your rope and and actually roping is helping you all the way around so I think that's an advantage that I do have is that this is what I do and um, no matter what I'm doing I'm, I'm helping myself but I think that now if if I wanted to get good at healing I think that I have to sh cut myself short on the other things and just heal you know especially healing because that right. takes me a lot that's that's an event that does not come natural to me that is an event that I've shed lots of tears over and it is so hard <laughs> me for me I cry I get mad and I just you know and so if I want to get good at that I have to cut myself a little bit short in the breakaway and the heading you know um it is a hard balance. It, it really is because I feel like the more that I concentrate on one, I'm slacking on the other. And at all times, there's always a breakaway rope or a team rope or, you know, there, it's just, it's, it's not like, okay, here's all these breakaway ropes. Let's concentrate on breakaway rope. And then there's going to be some team rope. It's all the time. I mean, it's every weekend. We might go from a breakaway rope straight to a team rope. And, and so, um, like I said, being, being able to rope and do all the events, I think helps just in understanding the horse and, and being able to ride and, and all that. But I do, it's hard to balance and make sure that you're getting enough of it, enough runs of every event. Right. And so it's, it's a hard balance, but uh, you know, I try to make it work. <laughs> just try to plan your days out the just, best you can. Yeah. And just, you know, certain horses might get headed on, you know, and that's the other thing in, in trying to find, you know, um, horses that are better for me that suit my time better these days those horses have to do multiple events I don't keep it's very rare that I keep one event horses all of my horses right now that I can calf rope on I can also head on and most of them I can heal on my good breakaway horse is a terrible heel horse so I don't I don't even attempt it it's awful but but most of them I do all three events on right and so um it's a little hard to balance like okay I'm gonna go break away some calves and then I'm going to go head. Well, I might've already roped calves on that horse. And, you know, so I might get to rope, you know, three or four calves and then go rope three or four heading or heel or whatever, and just try to rotate what horses get what each day and, and, um, make sure that I'm still getting enough runs and everything. 